was on my way back to the hood by them 20s. I mean them 10s, they 10s. But I keep them clean. I was on my way to buy them. This is Raw Jay Z. We back out again with another video. So basically, I told you I had something special for my bike. So basically, I'm doing something different. Instead of spray painting, power coating your bike, basically, I'm going. All right. So basically, we wrapping my mini bike. I got this wrap. Um. So basically, we finna do something way different. Nobody ever done this in the world. So basically, I'm the first person to ever wrap a mini bike. So let's get into it. This is the color. It's like a blue purplish with a metallic uh, sparkle in it. It faded in the color, you know, something different, you feel me? Nobody ever did this. So basically, I'm going to be the first one in the world. I'm going to be the hottest at first pull mini bike ride out. So let's get into it. All right, so this is the bike. I basically took everything off. I sanded some of the, the little high spot in the paint. Sand that down smooth so you won't see it in the wrap. Got the bars right there. So we're about to put y'all on the time lapse. And we're going to wrap this bike and we'll be right back. All right, so what we're doing right now is we're putting the wrap on. So what you do is, I learned from a mistake, obviously, is we pull the wrap um, by each side and then we aligned it. So what you do is you put your thumb and you make sure that it's flat in the middle. And you do like a fold at the, the edge. So all of it's like, don't got no bubbles or no crease. So right here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my pointing finger and I'm just going to smooth out the side. So when we fold it, it's just smooth. And we didn't do that before, so that's why the other side looked like crease and stuff. So what I do is, is I just use my whole hand and you see how it just connects. And underneath, we're going to have to use a blow dryer to um, make sure it stays in place. But you see how it's just flat and smooth. You don't have no air bubbles, you don't have no crease. Versus this side right here where you didn't know what to do. And you see how it messed up. You probably can't see it on camera that well, but it's like, it's all messed up. So we have extra, we will redo this side. But this whole side is complete and it's smooth from like, the whole thing, the whole bar is smooth versus this side right here. So now we know what to do. But we got basically this whole thing basically done. We're not gonna do the middle piece because that's where the motor goes, so it's gonna be hella oil right there. So we're not gonna do that. But you see the bike go different colors and different lighting. So you know we're about to be back. But what are you talking about? So we basically got wrap done. Well, we got the wrap done. Basically, we got some spare wrap. You know, we got some extra backup parts if the wrap mess up. But basically, we got the bike done. 
And I, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10 because, well, it's our first time doing it, so it's a lot of like, it's little spots that's messed up that we couldn't really, you know, it's our first time rapping anything. But the hardest part was rapping this back piece. Cause you see how it bends. That then the the it's a square. The, we cut the um, wraps in square pieces, and when you do it right here, it basically bends at an angle that the um, wrap wanna um the wrap wanna crease. So basically, what we did, we just heated it up. You can you can heat um heat the um the, the wrap up a little bit, but you don't want to do it too much because it can um break. But basically, I give this wrap a ten out of ten. For the color wise, you cannot do this with paint or anything, basically. So you go exotic with the color. So that's why I wanted to do wrap. I was gonna do something more brighter than this, but I didn't want to go too crazy. Feel me? But next time, I'm, I'm finna go. We finna wild out. You feel me? But I'm gonna put it in the light for y'all so y'all can see it. So let's get to it. You feel me? All right. So basically, why I like to wrap? It got like a chrome. You ever play like GTA and put a chrome wrap or Need for Speed? It got like a chrome wrap color to it. So it's a basically a blue switched into a purple. You see me looking good, looking good. But stuff that I did not wrap was the pegs. Cause if you see underneath, it scrapes. So basically it's no point of you doing that just for it to mess up. And another reason I didn't wrap the pegs or the brake because I don't know how slippery it'd be with your shoes. So basically I left the pegs. I'm just gonna clean cover this up. It may not let the like, bike look tacky, you feel me? I got a little, little dust on it, but you know, the bike look good, you feel me? But comment down below what y'all think. Y'all see the blue, the purple back there with the blue in the front. It got that chrome look. You feel me? Roll Jay Z did it first. So y'all remember that I did this first. You feel me? But if y'all are new to the channel, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and peace.